Okay, I, I know I look crazy. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I think this is gonna be maybe a get ready with me. Um, so right now I'm actually getting ready to get my day started. I have a bunch of errands to do. I got some work to do. I'm gonna be out and about, so I figure I might as well look like a human being while doing it. This is the um, the crochet afro install that I that I did. I got done by hair by half. If you guys missed the last video, definitely check it out. I share all the details there, but I've been enjoying it. I think I'm gonna rock it in a puff today. I'm just gonna use a little bit of gel. I don't want too much. Just around the perimeter. So how's everybody's summer going? I hope you're enjoying it. Um, my summer <laughs> has been crazy, you guys. So much shit has gone down. So much drama that I cannot even wait to fill you guys in on. But it's a story for another day. However, the weather has been amazing. We have been getting such such beautiful days and we have really short summers here um anybody who lives in toronto or even any of the like northern states new york chicago you guys know as well our summers are short so i have decided that despite the fact it's off to a rough start um i'm gonna get my my money's worth okay I'm gonna be out here every weekend doing something. So the girls and I have made a list of things we wanna accomplish this summer and we're knocking them out one by one. So far it's been good. We've been being out in the sun every weekend and if you follow me on my vlog channel then you'll see some of the antics that we've been getting into. Uh, we went on a boat ride, an all white party on the water, it was gorgeous. We did the Pride Blocko Party, um, Maya performed, and Big Frida performed. We, um, what else have we been up to? We threw two parties. We did an all black turn up. That was when our friends Gabe Babe TV came to visit. I love them so much. I still fan out, like, even though they're friends, but like, I'm still a fangirl. So if you want to see those videos, they are on my vlog channel. Gay Babe TV came down for, I think they were here for, <clears throat> excuse me, about four days, four or five days. So we also took advantage of the warm weather with them as well. We went to Niagara Falls. Um, they were in town right after the Raptors won. So we went downtown and did the whole Raptors parade thing in downtown Toronto. Sort of did a bit of sightseeing. Last weekend, we went to Afrofest here in Toronto, which is a huge African music festival, outdoor music festival that's held in Toronto annually every year. And that was a really good time as well. I get sads. Um, so yeah, winters are rough for me. So I'm trying to get all the vitamin D. <laughs> this summer girl hot girl summer okay i'm completely out of my mac studio fix in c8 that i always wear as powder foundation so right now i'm using this drugstore it's by maybelline fit me in the color coconut you know what i just realized i forgot to set my under eye concealer You guys know I always told you this is my favorite thing to set with, the Sephora Bright Set. It's it's empty. So I got this from e.l.f. If you guys checked out my e.l.f. haul. Um, but you know what? I don't really like it that much. Like, it does a good job setting, but it's not, even though it's called banana, it's not as yellow as banana. Do you know what I mean? So I find that this gives you flashback when you take pictures. So I just kind of use it sparingly and then I put, make sure I put powder on top of it, like my, my actual face powder. I wasn't even going to film today, you guys. Like I have been in such a mood lately. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's not y'all's fault. It's not y'all's fault at all. It's just some, you know, crazy family stuff going on. So I have not been in the mood to film, but to be honest, I got this beautiful handbag sent to me by, from a brand called Teddy Blake. 
And so I have to do, like I have to feature it um, in a video. So I figured a get ready with me would be a good one. So Teddy Blake, I don't know if you guys have ever heard of them, but I've actually received a handbag from them before years ago. And it's they're, they're beautiful handbags, like really good quality, designer, high-end quality at I would say like high street prices. So you get the luxury brand feel at a lower cost, like a high street cost. So here's how mine came. It comes in its own dust bag. And the one that I picked out was the, it's the Bella Vitello in 12 inch. And I got it in, you ready for this color? Woo, royal blue. She's so gorgeous, you guys. It is made in New York, 100% leather, just beautifully made, really high-end quality. Kind of reminds me of Kate Spade, like they do very minimal um, branding. So it kind of gives me that Kate Spade feel like very minimalist. And I love it. Bucket style. It's got zippers on either side and a huge inside. Um, it's all lined with blue suede and it comes with the long strap as well. So yeah, that just arrived in the mail. So I wanted to make sure I got the video up, you know, be a good vlogger. I'm not really in the mood for eyeliner, so I'm just gonna do mascara, I think. I'll just put a few coats of mascara and a gloss on. Or should I do a lip? What do you guys think? <laughs> I talked to you guys like it's live, I know. My face looks really round today. I feel like I don't have enough contour on. Am I bloated? I'm not sure what I'm gonna wear yet, so I'm just gonna go with a pretty neutral lippy, I think. My um, Fenty Stunna Lip Paint in Uncuffed. That's a nice, light, fresh looking beat for a hot summer day. Let me put on some clothes, girl.